tax season 2022 has arrived. The Internal Revenue Service starts accepting and processing 2021 tax returns Monday January 24, 17 days earlier than last tax season's late start of February 12. However, you might not have everything you need in order to file yet. This tax season, you'll need to be aware of some key issues, there will be differences in how jobless benefits will be treated compared with the 2020 returns. You'll also need to account for advanced child tax credit payments, the return of the recovery rebate credit, and a special break for charitable contributions among other things. As you get started putting together your returns, here are a few things to keep in mind the IRS is warning that a resurgence of COVID-19 infections on top of less funding authorization from Congress than the Biden administration had requested could make this filing season particularly challenging. Avoiding a paper tax return will be more important than ever this year to avert processing delays, he said. Red urge taxpayers to file their tax returns electronically and to get their refunds by direct deposit. The IRS says refunds can be directly deposited into bank accounts, prepaid debit cards or mobile apps as long as a routing and account number is provided, the IRS said. W-2s are due to be mailed no later than January 31st. According to the IRS, a 2015 law made it a permanent requirement that employers file copies of their Form W-2, Wage and Tax Statements, and Form W-3, Transmittal of Wage and Tax Statements, with the Social Security Administration by January 31. 